There's a new Professor Lando video. Oh, explaining hentai. <laughs> oh, oh. Let's let's go. Let's go. Chat, get ready. Get get ready, chat. Get ready. Hello, students. My name is Hello. Professor Lando, and uh, Hello, thank professor. you for joining me for class today. We're going to be taking a look at. A few different topics, some topics that haven't quite found their way into their individual lesson plan. Wait, wait, Chad, give me a moment. I need to, I need to change. I need to change. Um, we, we're going into school mode. Where am I? I need to change. Give me a moment, Chad. Up, 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 up. Here we go. Here we go. School uniform. <laughs> school uniform, Chad. Get ready. Go ready, check. Get ready. <laughs> Yet, and uh, although these topics might be different, uh, they're each peculiar in their own way. Now, the first yeah. of these topics that we're going to be going over today is stuck in wall. As the name implies, this Rabbit is a genre hole. <laughs> where you have a person that is stuck in a, you guessed it, a, a wall. wall. So for you visual learners like out there, like in the I've video Rabbit Hole. Diagram, here you have a representation of a common situation, common scenario you would find in the stuck in wall genre. Here you have a person who is stuck in the wall. And you can see here that generally speaking, when someone is stuck in a wall in this genre, they're going to be stuck at the waist, having their lower half yeah. separated from their top half. Now the person who is stuck, uh, the stuck E, as you will, is often flustered by the situation, obviously unable to see Look, all what is I want to know is why them, people as... like to make their chickens wear ties. That is what I am here to learn. Wait, what? <laughs> chickens as in chickens? Or chickens as in male chickens? It's a cock. They are obscured by a wall. Who exactly is behind that wall? And why a tie? No. And what is this person Thanks doing? The Taxes? <laughs> Unlikely. <laughs> and now to speak on the popularity of this genre, I think we can look outside the sphere of Japanese explicit media and Ten. see that in real life uh, explicit content, you have a common phrase that is known as okay. "Help me, step bro, I'm stuck." <laughs> where in this situation, a person in person find themselves stuck doing mundane help. Help me step chat, I'm stuck on a stream. <laughs> Household activities such as doing the laundry and getting stuck in a dryer, which again, just to highlight, goes to show how common this stuck in wall genre really strikes the heart of readers everywhere. Now moving on, a more niche, but perhaps a more versatile subgenre of the stuck in wall genre is the wormhole genre. Now what wormhole? makes the wormhole subgenre so unique Yo, and Wolfie. different from the stuck in wall genre is the portability my, of where the separation Wolfie. takes place. Oh, you can see oh, here in this example, oh, being oh, Rick from the oh, popular TV series oh. Rick and Morty, separated at the waist, but Unlike sure. its predecessor, the stuck in wall genre, these two halves are moved around. And in this scenario, Rick is behind himself, yeah. about to go to town. We're gonna have to buy some extra toothpaste after this one, Morty. Now, if you're having no. trouble understanding the appeal of these stuck genres, I can ask you a simple question. Have you ever had an itch on your back that you just can't quite reach? Yeah, awful, well, awful, same. awful. And uh, oh, in this situation, instead of a on your back, it's eating oh, no. your own ass. You could suck your own dick as well. Yeah. The next genre that I want to cover is the time stop Kids genre, to US. <laughs> where in the context of explicit <laughs> Japanese media, both fictional and in real life, a person or persons it's are a joke. frozen <laughs> it's in time or stuck in time. As you will, while the they have coitus <laughs> performed upon them by a secondary actor who is I'm often stuck. the protagonist who is exempt from being frozen in time, usually via I... some sort of mechanism involving the super. I've come across the stuck in the wall trip. I've come somewhat across the portal one. 
I've never come across the time stop one in any sort. Or natural or some sort of power. Now, I know what you're thinking that this might be one of the How strangest genres one? in the world. Zabordu! So, well, stopped, I wanted to take a moment to announce that my new merchandise lineup just released online. Show off your school spirit. I love the this. official this is so Living clever. University collaboration this is so with the Clothing this Lifestyle is so brand. Clever. Oh, yeah. Here we have the official Living University varsity hoodie jacket showcasing our official school mascot. Dude, it looks so good. Boy. It looks so well, good. Yes, the Living University t shirt that is in this maroon and white color, kind of mirroring my official professor outfit the red vest, the white undershirt. We also have this Ligman University hat. Yo! Meant to contain all of your big Play pulsating baseball. thoughts on your giant IQ brain, as well yes, as this yes, cross yes. body bag for you to store all of your essential school items. Such sick, as, sick. Oh, what's this? Ah, a detention slip signed by yours truly, as well as a little guy, as ah! in the official <laughs> Professor Lando. Oh, Plus. he's so cute! Get these items and more. Uh, by clicking the link down below and visiting <gasps> this so the Omina shop. Thank you again. Thank you to Omina for this amazing collaboration. And time resume. Oh. So the next genre we're going to be talking about is sissy hypno. So what is sissy hypno? Well, although sissy, sissy might be a derogatory term and has been used as such, really? sissy hypno what is, is a, a sissy? type of explicit media meant to hypnotize a target audience or otherwise influence like, them I hit, to become no, more but what submissive sissy? and breedable. This is a widespread okay. phenomenon on the internet. Now these are bite-sized clips that contain a fast-paced slideshow of images of women partaking in very explicit acts. And this slideshow... I love the trick and keeps his confused face. It's so funny. <laughs> You have to learn shit. Literally, I'm literally learning things. ...is interrupted by splices of text, instructions to the viewer to partake in very explicit and submissive acts. Examples of this text, these instructions, could be something along the lines of... Good girl. Okay. Get on your knees. Sure, okay. These clips are set to very trance-like music see, uh, and the beat of the music spliced with the very okay. fast cuts in the text give this uh sort of media its hypnotizing nature now if you're not quite understanding this uh genre yeah of media, i'm still I'll not offer you an ancillary comparison have you ever seen the marvel movie captain america winter soldier no, yes. no i actually well, have it's like no. that but instead of becoming a Russian sleeper agent terrorist super soldier, you start wearing a chastity cage and thigh highs. Oh, you hear that? I like thigh highs. It's time for gym. Physical education is a part of every important I, curriculum. I still don't get it. it's time for you to get some exercise. Students, settle down, settle down. I'm Coach Sugamoff, and it's time for some physical welcome. education. Here at Ligman I mean, University, hi. we offer welcome, a very... Welcome well-rounded curriculum. Not only are you gonna work out your mind, but here in my class, you're gonna work out your body. You can learn about sissy hypno, but until you start oh. my regimen, my submissive and breedable program, you're not gonna get anywhere. So submissive let's work and up breedable a sweat. program? All right, it's time to work out a sweat with this, my submissive and breedable program. Tight, We're doing three sets, 20 reps, a thigh highs. One, two, three, four, five. Put those bad boys yes. on. Pink yeah. stripes, yeah. pink stripes, lace, whatever you're imagining. Let's go, work yeah. it! Yeah! Oh, almost thigh people. highs! All right, moving oh, on straight to the next one. We're doing three sets, ten reps of Discord kittens. Let's get it! Discord one, kittens! Two, three, four. We're in so good. Mm. Come yes. on. You're not going to be Mine. daddy Fred's little kitten Mine. like that. Come on, let's hear you meow. Now this yeah. workout plan works once you're done with it you're going to be as submissive and breedable as you possibly can be but don't take my word for it check out this testimonial huh. yeah before this program i was a man's man but now retired man's pirate man. thanks lincoln university and get like you know, starting this program i was very skeptical but after doing this for 92 months i've Whoa. become submissive and breedable <gasps> it really worked you're a <laughs> 
Thank you so much to our Patreon supporters and a special shout out to the Wait, students that's it? here in detention. Check out my Patreon page for bonus what? content what like extended footage, it? art, and behind the scenes updates. This can't be. Thanks again. This can't be all! I still don't know what a sissy hypno is! I still don't know what a sissy hypno is! Professor Lando! <laughs> Where's the rest of the tags? Where are the rest of the tags? <laughs> what? <laughs> this can't be all. I need more. <laughs> Chat, why did I not have the um the the tag next to my name? Do I need to have like a hundred K subscribers to have like the tick next to my name? What is this? Can't believe he blue balled us. Let me Why he blue ball us like this man? You need to get to hundred K? Okay, we shall get there. We're almost at 20 k Thanks for watching YouTube! Thank you! Bye YouTube! Bye! Bye YouTube! Bye YouTube!